What's up guys, it's Nyoko here, back with another video, and today I'm going to be going over this really, really, really sick base design. Okay, so I call it the Omega base design because you can have these this base design on multiple servers, like an Omega tribe, such as one on the center, one on the island, one on the scorched, and on, so pretty much it's Omega tribe, or Omega base you put on multiple servers because it's just really it's really good because of the way that it's designed in the spot it's designed so pretty much you need to find a place like on the center I found a place like this it's kind of like a cliff with one entrance up and what you do is oh sorry for the buzz you just and you're gonna be a huge tribe in order to make this by the way uh, you just spam <laughs> you spam dino gates so what that does, it that's the only way for gigas and big land animals to get up. They're gonna have to blow through all that. Just look at it. It's just it's so intimidating if you see it. So also in back of that, you're gonna make sure you put uh, turret towers such as this, and of course at the bottom as well to defend from them uh, getting in. And you may ask, how are we gonna get our dinos up here? This this uh, part, this base. It's you can get dinos up there if you have like a Quetzal or something to get fly them up there, or you just have a dino pen uh, somewhere else near there because this is it's more defending like the loot and the um, dragons and I mean wyverns, excuse me. But, anyways, this right here is the main base part, so you're gonna have this at the top of the um, the what's it called the cliff itself or like whatever the one path entrance way up right at the top so this is just like a simple six I think it was six by eight or maybe eight by ten I forget but anyways it's just a simple box and what I did I just put um, the dino hatch frames with torrents on it two per and it's just it it's amazing the hatch frames it gives them gives the torrents like 360 view pretty much and also on the way up to the base itself, make sure you put multiple of those turret towers like I showed. And in any weak spots. You see a weak spot where you think they can blow in? Just pop a turret tower down. And down there, as you can see, that's where you can store all the dinos. For example, like you can just put gigas, whatever you want, just some turret towers surrounding it. And the main part of the base is just that, that huge cluster. That's just going to stop them, give you extra time to prepare as they're trying to raid you. So I hope you guys enjoyed this design. It was just a quick video. I just want to get it out. <laughs> and um, <clears throat> excuse me. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna have. I'm trying to do daily uploads. So stay tuned for that. And um, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this for more videos just like this and designs stuff like that. And um, yeah. So that that's the inside. It's just it's all <laughs> messy. I'm not good at interior design. So if you want to find something out like that, go look at like uh, Yosima or someone else that's really good at it. Don't forget to check my Twitter in the description. And I hope you guys have a great night. I'll see ya.